welcome back to my channel. Firstly, happy Diwali to all of you. So in today's video, I created three different looks using all drugstore products. I heard you guys and I know you wanted to see it. So I thought, why not release it on Diwali itself? Uh, so I really hope you guys love this. The links to all these products will be in the description box down below. So don't forget to check that out. So if you want to see how I got these three looks, then please continue watching. Hi guys, happy Diwali. I prepped my face, I'm gonna jump into foundation. I'm taking the LA Girl Illuminating and Matte Foundation both. I'm just gonna mix the two and put that on my face. I like the finish of both of these foundation. It gives me a really nice flawless finish since I mix foundations. I love mixing my products, like literally every product I mix. Um, that's how it gives me like the best of both worlds, you know. Um, I'm gonna jump into concealer. I'm taking the LA Girl Pro Conceal only. Uh, this is in the shade Pure Beige. I really wanted to take my most favorite base products for this video. Um, I know you guys were waiting for a Diwali tutorial, especially using drugstore products. So I thought, why not give you three looks in one shot? <laughs> so um, I'm waiting to know which look is your favorite. To brighten up, I'm gonna go in with the same thing. This is the Maybelline Fit Me in Sand Sable. This has been my go-to concealer combo since I started my channel. I love, love, love this combo so much. Um, and drugstore-wise, I think these are the best concealers I have come across. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna blend the two to give some dimension to my face. And then moving on to my brows, uh, I'm going to take the L'Oreal Brow Artist, I think that's called, and I'm just going to uh, put that on my brow. So this brow product is best if you don't have any brow hair or like, you know, you have very less brow hair, basically. This really paints on the brow perfectly. Now I'm going to take the LA Girl 3D Contour Palette, uh, 3D Blush Palette, and I'm just going to use that to um, bronze and contour my face. So this has a more pinkish side because I was also mixing the blush in as well a little bit. Um, so yeah, this is a nice product as well. Uh, everything that I used, I liked. So I'm just going to contour my nose as well and I'm going to take a stippling brush to blend everything out and make sure that it's seamless. This step I never miss. For highlighter, I'm taking the Makeup Revolution and Sofix palette. I'm bringing back the oldies, you know. Uh, it's such a good palette, guys, um, especially for makeup artists because there's so many shades in that. Uh, for blush, I'm going to take the Color Bar blush and I'm just going to put that on my cheeks. I like these blushes. They have like a very matte finish it's a matte illusion blush i guess they call um yeah so load that on and then we're gonna move on to eyes uh, for eyes i'm gonna take the Gigi hadid palette this is this has a lot of shimmers and mattes in it that's why i like it so i'm taking that neutral brownie shade and i'm just gonna put that all over my eyes that's all i'm gonna do for this look because um i know a lot of you do not you know like a lot of makeup on your face etc so i thought why not go from putting like a neutral eye to like a smoky one so this is what i do usually um i like just putting a nice transition shade into my onto my eyelids and they look so nice and then i'm again gonna take that same shade on a tiny brush and i'm just gonna put that on my lower lash line then for mascara i'm gonna use my favorite favorite uh, maybelline lash sensational and i'm just gonna put that on my lashes and for this one i said i'm not gonna go in with the falsy because it looks so nice my lashes look so long so voluminous so i i just left it at that i'm gonna take this peachy color lipstick again it's some color bar it'll be listed down below um i think it's in peach crush if i'm not wrong and i'm just gonna put that all over now i really wanted to use a nude lipstick i wanted to put like a nude one on top so i'm taking this Gigi hadid nude lipstick and you can take any light color and put that on top of your existing lipstick and it just neutralizes the whole thing you know i didn't want it to be so pink and then i'm just going to touch up on my brow bone highlight with the same sofix palette and put that in the inner corners as well and uh, yeah that is the final result for the first look this is how the first look is very simple very basic neutral perfect for my beginners um i really really love this look this is my favorite personally okay so let's move on to our second look 
<laughs> hello guys okay so for this one i'm just going to go in with that dark browny black shade and i'm going to put that on the outer corner of my eyes so now you can see i'm building up the eye look for the second one okay this is for my girls who want a little bit of something on their eyes you know i really like how this look turned out as well yeah like it's hard for me to pick i would typically go for the first one only but uh, i like how you can get so many looks with one palette you know you don't have to have a million palettes for different eye looks that's what i wanted to show you guys I'm just blending all of that out to make sure it's seamless and then I'm going to move on to that pinky shade and I'm going to put that on the center of my lid. Now, for my inner corner, I really wanted a pop of shimmer, okay? So I'm going to take that champagne color and I'm just going to put it in my inner corner, but I wanted to get it further more on the lid side. Uh, so I wet my brush a little more and look how um glowy and beautiful it looks now. It just completely intensified the shadow. So uh, that's a little trick. Just spritz something, water, anything to the brush and it look like I'm doing that again with the pink as well. I just wanted to get that color out more. I wanted it to pop more, give that bam look, but also keep it very subtle. It's not very shimmery like you can see because um I didn't want to go that route in the first place. I'm going to take that black and I'm going to smoke that on my lower lash line like I'm just intensifying what I did earlier, right? So I'm just going to intensify the shadow even more make it more smokier um and I also added some lashes if you missed it the very natural lashes I just put a band because I thought this look really needed it I'm going to go in with the faces ultimate pro lipstick and this is such a nice neutral color it it has sort of that matte and like a satin finish so it's very comfortable on the lips as well uh and I'm just going to add up the glow a little more because we've gone a little dramatic and smoky and I'm going to put on some more blush as well from that same contour palette uh look how nice it looks oh my god i like the blush color so much so basically i just intensified everything right so this is the final look for the second one um i like this as well look how nice it looks oh my god so diwali appropriate um yeah so i hope you guys like this as well Okay now for look number 3 I'm going to take my eyeshadow off first and start from scratch I'm going to take that neutral color and just go um, into my crease For my lid I'm taking the Wet n Wild Cat Suit um liquid eyeshadow I think and I'm just going to put that all over that's all I'm going to do for this one um this shadow is enough to like bring the look to life um what I love about this eyeshadow uh, product is that if you just tap your finger on it or use an eyeshadow brush the glitter particles come to life like you can see it started from a wet look to like literally the glitters are all over and it just looks so good in pictures and also reflects the light really well um so yeah i'm just using this and i'm using my brush to sort of remove that harsh line that i created uh with some like brown shadow and then i'm just taking those two and i'm just going to again smoke it out really well on the outer corner this is the last and final look so i really wanted to go all out for this one and make it very bold and very out there with glitters Again taking the same brown one I'm just going to put that on my lower lash line and put some champagne shade on my inner corner. For lips I'm going to take this red beautiful color bar I think satin lip it is really really nice it's a very good liquid lipstick. Um very comfortable formula and I wanted to put some kajal so I'm taking the Lakme kajal it's really nice guys. Um you know it just brought that whole mysterious look um and this is the final result for the third one i really hope you guys enjoyed watching this video let me know what your favorite look was and what are you going to wear tonight um thank you so much for watching guys the links to all the products will be down below so don't forget to check that out i love you so much and i will see you in my next video Mwah. happy diwali